bit lipping. I was waiting for that and it seemed to take a second to get going, which I suppose is appropriate considering it takes a moment for the software to start doing its thing. Yeah, welcome back. We're day 63, seven days to smash zombies. <coughs> totally fogged out. I can't see a thing. Well, almost. But certainly can't see any wandering snacks. Snacks, if I can say it. The word snacks. No, don't see any. Oh, right. Uh, where did I leave it? I know I've got cement. Uh, oh. Did I already have some sand ready? I did. I'll do some more as well in a bit. Uh, because I have been continuing my experimenting with different base designs. some more oil because uh I'll leave them in there oh, they're still making i'm going to want another two dark traps i think and then we're going to need a, a lot of ammunition dark traps as uh, as well we need darts to go in them so i'm going to have to make a lot of them and if i really do the base the way i would like to uh, some of the ways I've been experimenting with, obviously, as well, but um, making use of more steel. Uh, so, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'll see if I could do it. Um, if the worst comes to the worst, then I'll do day 70 here, the day 70 horde here. And in a way, it can help to prove how this base can uh, cope with it. And even more so, if you if you did use this base design, you know, you could add more dark traps and uh, more guns, etc. Yeah? It can be fortified further to cope with stronger hordes. But the hordes will be slightly... Uh, I'm not sure how much reduced they'd be because it's in the green forest zone. Um, what's the game stage at? 132. Yeah, I'm not sure if that changes by being in the wasteland and whether it will spawn. Uh, it won't be more numbers because the number is restricted by the game setting. But whether it spawns more difficult zombies or not, I don't know. Uh, I've never really tried comparing the two. The main reason I usually end up going to the the wasteland setup is just for the loot. Oh, yeah. yeah, there's some in the bench waiting to craft, so I'm going to leave them in there as well. What are you doing? That one. Why did... Oh, don't tell me I didn't click... <laughs> Oh, did I just mix one concrete? I did, I just mixed one concrete. <coughs> oh, I forgot to click the max button. Well, oh, I thought I'd clicked it and just didn't, like the mouse didn't register it or something, I don't know. Uh, no, not that one, not one. That's the medical trash. Um, we're up on tuna. That's only used for tuna toast, isn't it? Which means I can't do it yet. Because I don't have that recipe yet. Uh, how are we doing with food supplies? Still got plenty. Uh, I'll take one of them with me for now. I've got to go and hand in that quest. I want to... Uh, in a similar fashion to like I've done in recent episodes, I want to go and just do a quick, uh, either a mission or just a looting run through some super dark stormy weather. Uh, just through a POI just to make the, the loot table, do some rolling and see what 
might come out because I do still uh, need to upgrade my armor. That's a point, I forgot about that. What level of iron armor can I make? Um, right, let's just put iron in the title first. Yeah, tier 5, I thought it might be. Yeah, I'm tempted to do that instead of uh, a loot run because the armour is the main thing I've been thinking that really needs upgrading. Obviously weapons could still be improved. The pistol and the shotgun need to be improved, but... Yeah. Because uh, I don't have the skills in it, I don't think... My production of something like a, a shotgun will be that good because I ain't got the, the skill level to go with it. If I've even got the schematic for it, I don't know if I have. I've got M60 would come out at tier 4. Uh, <laughs> yes, I would like one of them if I can scrape together the parts. But only tier 4, I'd rather get it at tier 5. And I can do the pump shotgun at tier two. No, <laughs> no you're right. Uh, let's see where. Yeah, only one point in shotgun. Three in machine gunner, and to get it higher, I think needs seven. Yeah, can't quite get to it quick enough. Unless I can gain a couple of levels, uh, which I might very well do during this incoming horde night tonight. Nothing in the agility ones, and uh, it's just them, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, you need eight for that, don't you? Not seven. That cost me five points. But it would get me the increased experience. Considering a lot of the kills that I'm getting now being caused by the traps. Uh, although that would be more applicable with the next base, not this one. Uh, not agility or. If I want that, seven, so that's going to cost me uh, another five points, isn't it? Yeah. But that would mean I could build a tier five M60. Oh, decisions. Um, how much normal iron have I got? Not enough to be making armor from. Be done soon enough. That iron's almost finished smelting as well. Could do with getting more iron. <laughs> <coughs> I thought I'd still got a fair bit in stock. Right. Uh, let's start with a hundred. Should give me enough to make at least two pieces of armor. Um, what was the other required parts? Uh, my boots aren't too bad, so I don't necessarily need to do them. Definitely need to do the chest armor. Got plenty of leather. We'll have plenty of. Uh, Forged iron fairly soon. Got certainly got plenty of sewing kits. And it's all going to be the same, isn't it? Yeah, every piece is the same recipe. There's a steel. I doubt the iron ones would be better than a tier four steel. But 
gloves and the chest piece. I might make a helmet as well just to see if it comes out better than that. Scrap iron boots. Uh, yeah, I don't think they'd come out better than what I've already got. And the tier 6 means it's got a lot more... Uh, well, it's got one extra storage space. I've only got 11 left. I need more tin cans. Which is something I don't normally bother to keep. No, I've got none in storage, so I'm going to have to make some tin cans. I'm staring at them again. I was doing that before. Sand lift? No, no sand lift. So I do a clear thousand. It'll be a little while till that comes out. Right then. Uh, well, while Mr. Trader is open, let's nip over there and see what we can see of what he's got uh, no, I'll leave them save them for when there's something really good I want to buy and I need an influx of cash uh, hang on, let's just check if I left anything behind uh, I need a treasure map which can stay there if he's got something super duper, then I'll get a sugar butts, but I don't think he restocks until tomorrow. Which means he's only got stuff that I've already looked at. Uh, yes, actually. I have a few of them for tonight. I'll probably end up using more firearms than melee. Well, you're a sight for sore eyes. Oh. It must be my lucky day. Oh. Thank you. Uh, yeah, definitely. Thank you. There you go. I was after some weapon improvements. That'll definitely improve the crossbow. Oh, and we finished the tier four. Cool. I was hoping it would do. And he's got an M60 machine gun bundle. Compared to what? Blade traps? No. Melee mods? I've got a few in storage. Same as the range mods one. Certainly don't need the food bundle, so yeah, definitely the M60 bundle. Cheers, mate. Any special jobs? I could really uh, use some help. Oh, friend. Trader Gen. I wonder if that's the one down in the wasteland. It's rare to find honor in these dark times. Cool. That was a good coincidence, the fact that it was the end of that tier. Look under mods. Yeah, it's still the same stuff I've been selling him. Is there anything else worth me getting? The AP ammo. No. That was a multiplayer one, was it? Yeah, land claim blocks. Don't need that. Waste of space. I've got plenty of them. He's got that three oil. Well, uh, no, it's not enough. You have a great day now. Three oil isn't really going to cut it, so I'll just make my own. Um, it's not exactly a lot of time to go looting, considering I want to make some of this other stuff. But first of all, let's see what we've got in our M60 bundle. Please be at least tier five. Yes, nice. <coughs> that, is, that is really lucky. A tier six crossbow. Well, a compound crossbow as well, even. And a tier five M60. Uh, let's hope that they don't 
uh, purposefully, for in some manner, do something in the horde tonight. This is going to completely mess me up. Because <laughs> so at the moment, it seems like the game's been just uh, too nice. I even had to stop for a moment then and do a little pirouette. Like, yeah. <laughs> Ranged 101. Yeah, it's definitely better than. Do I have that out? And what else could we put in it considering it's now tier 6? No hunter mod. Uh, I certainly want a scope on it, but I don't think you can put uh, 8 times on. I do have the parts to make different. Mm. Let's just check if I drop one in here. No. Uh, let's see if I can put the uh, tempered blade mod on it. It might reduce the the wear and tear, maybe. No. Right then, it's, uh, it's time to make a four times. Yeah, I thought that was the reason why I'd been collecting the uh, um, broken grass from now. I can't think of the words tonight. dark again. No, where is it? It's the next there. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> I was just randomly clicking buttons on the keyboard. <coughs> Scrap blue steel and broken glass. Use a little bit of that steel just for this. Pretty sure you can put a four times scope on it. I'll leave it till that ammunition's done. Right then. Uh, can I make a hunter's mod? That's the only other thing that I think is really worth. No, I can't. Um, I can't think of another mod that's worth putting on there crossbow that I can actually make. Might end up just leaving one empty slot for now. Yeah, I can't. Uh, arrow rest mod doesn't work on a crossbow. I can't make any others like cripple them maybe would work I think. Yeah, oh well, that's a shame. Um, right. No point putting an 8 times scope on an M60. No, uh, that. That won't go on an M60 either. Definitely want a full auto mod. Do I not have one? Definitely want that. That's one slot. Can I make a drum mag? Oh, please say I can make a drum mag. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm going to be constant. Ah, oh, damn. I'm going to be constantly changing uh, or reloading ammo. It's going to feel like it's constant. In which case, do I want a full auto mod? Because <laughs> the full auto mod really is for the... Uh, the opportunity of having a massive magazine, a drum magazine on there, so you've got tons of ammo, you can just hold the button down. And when you get some of the other machine gun books that give you bonuses for a continuous fire, that kind of thing. Right, I can't do them. Yeah, this is like a planning episode. Now I've got some new toys, you said, right, what can I do with them? 
<coughs> what I need to do is harvest more iron and be making a lot more steel and cement or con concrete I should say uh, I can go for selling Can you actually do 132? Right, okay then. We are definitely going to have to get more iron. Press too many times. There, yeah, just do 100. Uh, I'll put it away for now. I'm going to end up getting it out again in two seconds for making the armor. And the oil. Is that still burning? You fool of a talk, you left it burning. Twenty-four minutes, well. I've got plenty of fuel. If I need to do glue for some reason, I'll do it in the fireplace. Okay. Oh, that was that extra stack of ammo I wanted. Go back to doing the iron armor. Uh, do the chest piece. Leather, duct tape, salmon kit, iron. Like a lion in Zion. I need a few more of them, so let's make some more. And leather. So we can keep Dang, I've forgotten already what else was it. Why are you showing that? I'm not. I have to scroll it down. Where's the chest piece gone? Come on, don't stare at it and not see it. There you go. It was just those four items. I thought there was another item for some reason. Yeah, do all of them because I'll be making more than one piece of armour. Do the chest and the gloves to start with and then see what I've got left. <coughs> Probably be more than enough, but I don't want to splooge it all too soon. You now fit on my nice shiny crossbow, yes, cool. Yeah, hunter's mod or maybe a crippler mod. If it'll allow me to put that in there, I think it does. Yeah, nice. So now we can be getting a lot more power from the crossbow. Make it much more useful as a stealth weapon and for the firing the explosive arrows as well will make a nice difference oh you can't put the semi mod on there yeah uh, an anti-rad would be good in that the drum mag was what i really wanted so do i have anything else that would be a good transfer if I'm only going to use that for explosive ammo there's no point leaving the anti-rad in it it'd be better off going in the M60 so that's a possibility that can only have that on the uh, the armrest would be good if I'm planning to run around like run and gun with the M60 which is a fairly good way to make use of it once you've got the skill built up a bit just have a good supply of ammunition and uh, obviously a drum mag on the uh, M60 and then you can just collect these the zombies up into a little pack and do circles around them while you just hold the, the fire button down <laughs> I've done that quite often just ball them up like a like the dolphins collect fish together, you, know, you ball them up into a group and then you just do circles around them, blasting them. 
Okay, well. Uh, yeah, okay, let's take the anti rad out of that. And put it in here. It's the shame about the drum mag. I can't have everything considering all the other bonuses it's given me now in that sense. Upgrades. Let's just shuffle this around and stick it. Right. A combination of fire rate. Railing too far. Right, how much can you actually hold with that mag extender? 85. Uh, yeah, we'd like to double that, preferably. Because 85 won't last very long. <laughs> And there's not a lot of point putting sights on this. The only one I've ever found useful is the the reticule, the one with the little, you know, you get a little glass sight on the top with the laser dot on it. Oh, that's going to take a while. Them should now be all done. Oh, hopefully this is better than what I'm wearing. Yeah. A little bit. That's good. That'll do. Right then. Also means we can fit one more mod in it. Let's see what we got that might be useful. Nothing. I suppose I could put that in there, even though I don't exactly do sneak in much. Um, can't put extra pocket mods in, you can only put one set of pocket mods in. <coughs> what about, can I make uh, heat, or, or yeah, I can do insulating. Can I do the cooling mod? No. No, it'd be down here under C for cooling if I could. I'll just check, well, yeah, can't do it, so... Would heating be any use to me at the moment? No, I'm doing okay on heat. It's the cold resist I need to increase. I'll leave one, one slot empty then. And maybe we'll find some... Well, I'll leave it with the muffles in. Just uh, make use of them for now. But I'll change them out to a, a cooling mesh if I find one. Let's do the gloves next. It's the same recipe, isn't it? I've got enough on me. Yeah, I have. Now I've changed the search results again. Well, what am I short of? Ah, four bits of iron. more dark traps. Uh, it should be enough oil done by now, yeah. What else was it? Mechanical electrical and forged iron. Using a fair bit of forged iron, I need to topple these two as well. To go out <coughs> in the, uh, following the horde like tomorrow, I'll have to go and do some scrapping and scrounging right at the start. You film, right. can't fit uh, not enough iron. I can't get one going. Iron. Yeah, that's enough. I'll do another one. Right, that's them two underway. 
That's going to block the time for me making other armor pieces, though, isn't it? Okay. <laughs> Give me all the bits back. At least I've got them in, in the inventory now, ready to make use of. Let's have a quick bit of cleaning up. Uh, not in there. I haven't got any others in there yet. Okay. We'll come back to that. That can go in there now. As can that. I've got more than I wanted, definitely. Yeah, hopefully that will suffice. <laughs> hopefully. I've got grenades, got a few pipe bombs. I've got no explosive arrows. Right. Nothing smelting in you. That's no good. I'm going to have to use that up now. Decisions, decisions. I've either got to start making iron darts or making more steel. <coughs> I think the iron darts probably take priority. Only 332, can't even do 500. Okay, I'll leave you smelting for a bit and I'll come back to you because I want at least a full stack. Oh, that's that. Sand. Give me that. Hey, I've got to uh, keep on top of producing concrete because when I've been experimenting with the base building, <laughs> I'm going to need to double that at least. Uh, yeah, easily I need to double that. I need about 15,000. And that's even just keeping it somewhat modest. I've tried to compact the size and whatever as much as I can, but still make it function the way I'm wanting. But in the way I've designed it, it's going to take uh, over 10,000 concrete. I'm thinking it's more likely going to be about 12,000. Because I went through about 1,200 building frames, the wooden frame blocks. And each block represents 10 concrete when you turn it into concrete. So, yeah, that's about 12,000 concrete at least. Right, gloves. I hope you're better. I'm sure you will be. Yeah, cool. About the same as the last, uh, the iron chest armour. In terms of the increase, uh, can't put any better pocket mods in there yet. Could really do with finding some of them three slot pocket mods. And the same with this one, I've got nothing else that I can put into that empty slot, so it'll just have to stay empty for now. Try making a helmet. I'm just hoping it'll be a little bit better being a heavy armor type rather than that helmet, which is obviously light armor type. Uh, still a bit more. Uh, you've still got stone in you. Yeah. I've got enough iron on me yet. Take me back to the iron armor so I can make one of these and stick it on the head. Couple of minutes, right. I won't risk the leggings. 
because that'll be consuming a uh, more iron and I'm somewhat limited on the iron at the moment and as I said I won't do the boots because the uh, the tier 6 scrap boots uh, I think the of course I need iron for that as well damn I'm gonna use a all my iron it's only going to be enough to make one. Uh, I need more iron as well then. At least a little bit. I know I've got some more in the other box under the smelter, but that's for repairing. <coughs> that's uh, I, I like to keep those stacks separate. Like these bits in here are for the repairing of the base when we're fighting the horde, so I try to keep them separate and not dip into them. So I don't need that. Don't need that on me in here. Uh, mud can go away, don't need that. I thought it might end up like this. It's already 7 p.m. in the game and I'm finished with crafting stuff. <coughs> and these are for the down in the other base, so I don't need to pick them up or anything. They can just stay where they are once they're finished crafting. Yeah, all right, that'll be the second one of them. All this lot back again. One ding. All right. Is it? Yeah, it is. Well, it's protective value and whatever is better than. That's what I was mainly worried about. Uh, can make use of the water filter as well now with that tier 5. Still keep the red theme. Nope, why did I close it full? Right, and that will have improved my armour rating a bit. Show it on this one, oh, no, it must be the next one. Yeah, that's not too bad now. Still room for improvement, and of course, definitely room for tier 60s to get that extra mod slot. So I've managed, even without trying, I was thinking I was going to have to go run around, do some raiding and things like that to try and improve my, my gear ready for down in the wasteland and also for tonight because I think this horde's going to be fairly heavy in terms of the level of zombies turning up <coughs> and I didn't have to go anywhere got a decent new bow and uh, machine gun was just planning to try and make one anyway and I didn't have to leave the home base right then, what are we up to oh uh, I think we're going to run out of iron with just enough to make one stack. Oh, that's done. Oh, it'll be done when it's finished making that. Oh, that's done. Oh, I'll just stuff some more stone into you. Oh, we'll actually need to keep some of it for making further batches of concrete. You can be stuck up with half each. Keep churning out more. Yeah, I'll just leave that to run on. And encourage some screamers to turn up, maybe. Right, you can have that. 
It's time to start getting ready for the horde to turn up. Let's grab the... Um, yeah, I'll put that back. I'm not likely to need it before the end of the night. And... That. Uh, I'll have a couple of them. Three. Yeah, three will do. I can always rush back to the box if I want to grab more. I've got any beer. Does beer only apply to brawling damage or does it apply to melee? No, it's only brawling. But it does give a stun resist. And regen. Okay, yeah, let's take a little stack of them as well. I thought I had more. Uh, what are they called? Skull crushers. No. Uh, maybe they're in my other board box. Uh, one. And I want a couple of them. Uh, maybe take some of them in case. I'll come back to the box if I need like splints and things. I don't want to overload myself. Uh, maybe take them two as extra. I didn't make the explosive arrows. It might be time. Always duct tape. <laughs> it's like the, the thing about the apocalypse, it's always duct tape. Um, what was it? Um, yeah, it's only one duct tape per. Okay. Compared to scrap arrowheads. Grab the lot of it and scrap polymer. Uh, I'm just going to make six. Hopefully, that will be enough just for those occasions when the opportunity comes up to fire one down range I've got to be careful not to end up shooting me shooting them in my own face oh, that's gonna get consumed and this little lot You're not going to quite finish. I, I don't exactly need you immediately. I don't want to leave you wasting fuel. These two are at least doing something. Although well, that's going to run out soon. So I need just that cement mix of uh, cement smelter going. In the battery is back up in case the generator fails for some reason. Right. A few seconds. Oh, need to pick up all my ammo. It's definitely going to be mainly 762, I think. Um, let's just have uh, three of them for now. I think I doubt I'm going to use more than that with the shotgun. I've still got me blooming. It's going to 
have to be the chopper to move out the way. Oh, there's going to be more space here. I forgot to dump the, the duct tape. <laughs> Never mind. Keep the liquid topped up a bit. So one of them. And one of them. I won't use the four bikes yet. I'll wait until there's some kind of need for them. Just keep my tools together so I can see them easier. Come on, mate, that's it. We are here to bunk. Day 63. Get them before they even get to the window. Yeah, Mr. Bunkinator's doing his job. Sinning out the herd. <coughs> oh, she went for a flyer. Yeah. Oi. Get away from the pillars. Oh. Yeah, but it's not for you. All right, let's give it a test out. Staying for the center of mass. Oh, slides to the left a bit. Works well. Yeah. At least my reload time's not too slow. Come on. Oh, we stood up in the way. You. Get out of it. Oh, sounds like there's a few of them having fun down there. Right. Oh. oh, that was close with that copper. Hang on, mate, I gotta reload. Get out of the way! Oh, did that reload? No, it didn't. Come on, all you zombie masses. Zombies gathered in their masses Cause they've all just had their vaccines oh. yeah, It is very effective but consumes ammo at a rapid rate Just for you, nursey. <laughs> that was a bit of a close bounce then. I use those rock busters now they're actually, well, apart from right at the start, I haven't bashed that many zombies. <coughs> Let's leave them a bit of chance to get closer. Hey! Oh, 
more coppers coming in. Oh. <laughs> Don't last long against the dark truck. The ferals do. Who are getting close enough? There you go. Right. Get out of it. Oh, he made it through the tiny gap. <laughs> How'd you get in? Get out of it. Where did he come from? Eh? He's got some kind of magic trick. Well, I don't know where he got in from. shoot myself in the face with that. I can hear him. Don't know where they are. Uh, it's just a shadow. Good evening, ma'am. Did you order two? Oh, now we've got some white showing up. No demolishers there. Still save the guns. I haven't turned them on yet because I don't want to use the ammo until the demolishers start showing up. Oh. I just realised I got a broken arm, is it? Have some of my nine mil. Ow. <laughs> you can jump, but you can't get up there. Hey, what? Just to make sure you can't jump in here. Oh. <laughs> Spiders are flying all over the place tonight. Ah, oh, you stood up in the way. Just as I was about to fly over. Oh, spiders and white. Save the, the last two. Oh, miles up. Jumping out! 
a bit again. Trying to get uh, headshots if I can, but mainly go for the upper body. It's more guaranteed to hit than while they're jiggling about and running at you and whatever. I won't use the other. Gold crushers because I'm just using too much ammunition rather than melee. Uh, oh, hello, love. something new. Hey, don't want spiders rum riding on the back of other zombies, that's unfair. You gotta get closer mate. That's it, keep coming. Oh, I think the other electric fence needs repairing. Spit at me. Oh, keep it going. No, it's no good hanging around, right? Have I moved on from there? <laughs> Fuck you, Kappa! Oh, I've got far more shotgun ammo than 9mm. Save the 9mm for the... The pistol later. Ooh, let the dogs in. Oh, oh it wasn't reloaded. Keep it, 
give yourself a little tap of That's it, run, run! Dog's been coming up here. Right. I saw ya. Oh, that just about dodged that. Eh? the dawn time. Not one demolisher. I'm surprised at that for day 63. Come on, you're too slow. Shot one of his legs off and he's still going. <coughs> oh, they're not that little barrier down there. Oh, he's gonna be mad. <laughs> Alright, let's finish him off with the M60. Still a doggy down there somewhere. Yeah. Yeah, they went off with a flyer. Oh, still him left. Alright, oh, were you the last one then? Yeah, I think he was. Oh. I am surprised not a single demolisher turned up. That's alright. No, even that got damaged. They don't usually take damage. There was a fair bit of cup vomit flying around. Uh. <coughs> oh, yeah. Oh. I haven't got any concrete on me for repairing concrete. That was a mistake. I forgot that bit. I got the iron and steel, yeah. And the electrical parts obviously just forgot to pick up the concrete. No matter, we did all right with that. Uh, I'll turn the generator off for now, but I'll leave the batteries running. Just keep the lines charged. 
And I didn't have to turn the guns on once. Hmm. Alright, let's sort some of these bits out. Uh, although I do want to go and grab all the loot as well, so I'm going to want to dump most of this stuff. Yeah, actually did quite well with that in terms of how much ammunition I used, I'm surprised. A few... So eight grenades... Four stacks, nearly four stacks of 7.62 or around four stacks, two stack, was it? One and a half of shotgun ammo. That seems, I don't know, that just seems a bit odd to me. Like there wasn't, uh, or maybe it's just because I've got slightly better weapons. I don't know. Just seemed they were maybe being killed off quicker. I haven't changed any of the settings, so it's still at wadier difficulty, so... Well, well, just take the win. Just take the win. We survived that quite successfully. I'm going to, first of all, put the repair stuff back where I want it. And then I'll dump the other stuff and go and grab all the loot bags. Uh, Save the coffee as well. Uh, nail gun can go in there. I worry about repairs tomorrow. Well, I know it is tomorrow already, but you know what I mean. <laughs> the next game through. Uh, yeah, didn't really use any of them. A couple of them got used. Oh, did I not make more red tea? I thought I made a load of. Yeah. There it is. I thought I had made something. Right then, what else can we dump and where? Uh, that can go in there. That can go... Uh, I suppose really it ought to go in a hoard box at the front, shouldn't it? Let me drop off some of these bits. Just putting all of this lot in here for now. And we can see what we get out of the loot box. Bags. I don't know why I keep saying box. Loot bags. Try and remember that I did also loot one earlier from the inside. Might very well have lost one or two bags, although I don't think any of the cops exploded this time. So hopefully we didn't lose any of the loot bags, although it's all going to be just general tap by the looks of it. Not one demolisher. Oh, it's more still tool parts. Not like I really need them at the moment. Now I've got all the steel tool equipment. Some few bits of steel as well. That was a decent amount of money. Yeah, a lot of steel tool, steel tool parts for some reason. Rather than an actual weapon, it's just giving me parts. Don't know if that's something to do with the loot stage, probably. Oh, got some coffee back. Uh, super crappy tier one iron helmet. Oh, and now I've just got three wood as well. <laughs> Uh, quite a lot of magnum ammo. Uh, if 
I had more skill in the Magnum, I'd bother to make one. It's a second mask. Right, I think it is. Mr. Bunkernator survived. Uh, don't see anything super major damage wise. I've done a fair bit of damage to these. Uh, a bit round there. Yeah, looking okay. have a spare box to use because it would make it easy if I just made a specific dumping box or something. Uh, I'll use one of them. Yeah, I picked up three wood because I, I just wanted to smack that bush and get it out of the way. But it meant I ended up with three extra wood in my bag. Uh, no, I want a writable one. Just so I can write something appropriate like loot dump or hoard loot, whatever. Right. Just going to put it there. Let me drop all of that in there. We also found at least one or two bandages and sort through it what we get. Yeah, Magnum ammo. Bit of crap armor. Hazmat masks. A little bit of money and food. Right, that, that was fairly crap. But, uh, yeah, that was bad for day 63. That. That's not good at all. Certainly didn't even make the ammunition back that I expended. I mean, there's some ammunition, but it's not much. A bit of food and that, yeah. The steel tool parts are probably the most, to me, the most valuable stuff that it's given me. And it's that's crap for day 63. Well, there you go, folks. Day 63 horde smashed. Uh, this base design just keeps proving itself capable. As long as you're, like, keeping on top of what you're doing and you've got plenty of ammunition so yeah we'll leave it at that and tomorrow we'll do some clean up and resource gathering and you know all the bits ready for preparation for the wasteland area and wait for my arm to heal uh yeah let's just quickly grab a, a health bar and not put them in there right. Probably in the medical box. No. Oh dear, I've got no health bars. No, it's there. Right. It's in with the candies, that's why. Just explain to myself my own filing system. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Catch you in the next one, folks. Thanks for watching. Catch you.